today uh, we have a career on wheels event and the third through fifth graders are getting to go to each individual vehicle to interview the professional that's related to that vehicle and ask them all kinds of um, questions that have to do with their career and their training that they had to get or their college degree that they had to get to um, get into that position that they're in. If I was to hook this up, I would put that mast up in the air. I would swivel that dish around until I found the station. We have several community partners that came that um, I contacted and it's been great to see um, the enthusi enthusiasm that they've had to come and um, work with the kids. We have um, EMT and uh, Channel 12, firemen, the police, and the police brought the K-9 unit and um, their horses, so their mounted unit came out, and uh, Summit Truck Group brought some of their vehicles, and the city of Wichita brought street sweeper and a uh, snowplow, so uh, quite the variety. <laughs> Oh, okay, that. I think that it's um, a much more tangible event for them, and so they like to see the vehicles uh, versus bringing in the professional and just having them stand and talk in front of the kiddos. Um, I think just having something to associate that career uh, with the professional is um, a lot more, it's just able for them to understand it a little bit more. Just walking around, it's really turned out to be a great thing, and the kids have been really excited and um, asking really great questions to these professionals. But the difference between the city and the county is the city has a breed ordinance for, let's say, pit bulls. The county does not have a breed ordinance. They've been asking them what kinds of uh, training they've had to have specifically, and then what kinds of um, if they had to go to a community college or four-year college, what kinds of responsibilities they have and what their supervisors ask them to do. And um, the professionals are also relaying the message that you need to be responsible and listen and follow directions is key in it now in school and as you get older. And that's something the kids need to hear. You'll see us in our patrol car driving around protecting people and trying to keep the streets safe for everybody. When you talk about careers to the elementary level, they automatically think of police and firemen um, is usually what already comes to mind, or the teacher, because that's what they see every day is in the school and professionals in the school. And I think that they've been excited to see that there's just a whole a whole bunch of different things in our community that they that they have access to becoming and um, and more. Thank you. Well, thank you.